So here I am diving into the War Thunder replay system because I ballsed up the live recording. So that means you're going to have to suffer through another video where my crosshair appears to lag behind my target. So you're just going to have to take for granted that I am pulling the proper lead. You know, don't take for granted, just watch the enemy aircraft falling down to the ground in a giant flaming pile. That works just as well. So, here I am. We are abusing the Yak-1 to 2.0, which means you go up against aircraft like this. Yeah, reserve versus a 20 millimeter cannon. Goes about as well as you expect. That's an I-16 back there. I'm trying to get a nail on me, but I'm outpacing him. He only gets uh, one dink on my wing. He really didn't go all out on his gunfire. Probably should have, but whatever. That Kai 21's fortunate that he has more than one pilot. He's also pretty fortunate that high explosive rounds don't really work so well when you're hit, hitting them from the direct rear. Basically anything other than a broadside and the effectiveness of those rounds are greatly diminished. Case in point, there's a hurricane with his wing shredded and a few hits. I'm going to have to save this A5M4, P36, and no one else is around to do anything about it. And freeze frame. I am now on fire. P36 is in front of me. A5M4 is in front of the P36, getting his shit pushed in. And no one else is around for miles. So, what got me? Well, according to the battle log, the P-36 did. Now, I know I was behind the P-36 this entire time. I didn't just accidentally slip in front of them. Though, to be fair, I'm just riding his elevator. And I know the hit detection is server-sided, but... In what universe do the guns start, like, 0.2 kilometers behind the aircraft? So I loop back around, getting it, trying to get another line of the P-36. I'm just trying to kill him before my Yak-1 finally bites it. But as Providence would have it, my fire goes out. It's just that now my wing and aerolons are completely busted, and my control is, well, to put it lightly, compromised. Pretty much the same thing with the A6M0. All my fuel is now leaking out of my right wing, so once that settles, I pretty much am completely imbalanced with only my fuel in the fuselage and left wing left. And this means I'm pulling hard to the right pretty consistently. So like the A6M0, it's taking rudder input 
and a constant left roll just to keep this thing centered. But am I deterred? No. I don't care that my turning ability is severely compromised. That I pretty much dipped too far in trying to chase that I-16. I got a 20 millimeter cannon, and they got reserves. And I can't keep my gun sight on that guy worth a damn. That works. So I'm taking looks back behind me. Nobody is around me, which is fortunate for me because, well, free yak one kill right here. Now I set the hurricane on fire. Again, running afoul of the hit detection. And I spun the thing out. As Providence would have it, I recover. I mean, it took like full right roll and then full right rudder to get it going in one direction, and then full left roll and then full left rudder just to get it in a flying condition again before I plow into the ground. And was that not one of the damnedest things I've ever seen? In fact, we can count the number of damnedest things I've never seen in this match, like up to three or four or whatever. This this is crazy go nuts. Yeah, dude, you're not out turning a Chica. But you might just get him as you, long as he remains fixated on the aircraft. Or he can just balls up his turn after you critted him and get net me a free kill. That works too. So, right there I'm just, just checking out the damage on my wing. There's a nice big hole through it. Now the fragmentation rounds decide uh, they didn't really want to work today, so most of my crap just whiffs. I mean, for you, the only true indication I have of getting these hits is the hit indicator on my crosshair. I finally wear that guy down. Took a lot of ammo though. And sure, I'll go for a snapshot on uh, P-26. Because 20 millimeter cannon on a 2.0. It's actually a 2.3, but BRB is down to 2.0. No, I don't get the kill on that BBY. Would have been entertaining though. Hello! Oh, I'm gracious, dude. Do you mind, uh, you know, backing up a little bit? Actually, no, don't back up. Had he did, I would've rammed into you. Just, you know, anything that gives me distance.
Yeah, just remember, my controls are still crippled. And yet, I'm still nailing these shots. Sadly, I don't get this swordfish. I burned the rest of my cannon ammo, so it'll reload, and I can still use my MGs. But the match ends before you know, any of those will reload. So let's just have this F2A1 before the match ends. Doesn't get count on my kill count. Would have been 16 had that buffalo counted. But yeah, Gaijin. Takes more than a little shenanigans from you to bring me down. Next time, give it your A game. Like, um, you know, lag spike into the ground. Yeah, that'll do it.